just the reason why I get up in the morning, it's what drives me. My name is Katie, I'm the Artistic Director of Blooming Buds Theatre Company and we're at the Rockwell Community Centre in Forpedge in Bradford. I set up Blooming Buds in my first year of university and that was because I felt very alienated at times because of my background, where I was from. Not many people that I knew had gone to university, especially in the theatre world and the arts world. It can be very privileged at times. I've had people saying to me, I'm not going to speak to you unless you speak properly because of my accent. So I was determined to set something up for people like me and that's why I set up Blooming Buds. Blooming Buds runs the whole of the Rockwell Community Centre and it's run as a community arts and cultural hub. It does all the typical community centre type things like food parcels, debt management, housing support, but we also make live theatre in and around the community. The place is lovely. Every person I've met here, they've been lovely to me. I can't thank them enough. It's just amazing. I don't know what I'd do on a Friday if I didn't come here. I've grown up with anxiety a lot of my life and theatre enabled me to become somebody else on stage. It's an important part of anyone's life. We all listen to music, read books, watch television and I recognise the power of the arts, how it can change people's lives. When I found out I won the National Lottery Award, I cried. Um, I was super happy, I was really excited, really feel privileged that I've been recognised nationally out of so many people. You know, I refer to myself as just another lass from Four Pedge. I, you know, I, I do what I do because I care um, and I really want to make a difference to people's lives. Blooming Buds has changed my life, has helped my mental health, made me a better person, got me involved in a lot more and I have met a lot of people since I've been here. In the arts there's a conception that you have to move to London to make it but I was determined that we'd stay up north and back in my hometown. I'm just happy that Four Pedge is being put on the map because, you know, it's a council estate but lots of great things happen here. We've had a volunteer called Rob who is very open about his story of drug recovery. He now um, facilitates mental health groups and he came to us and said, I just want to fill my life with positive things and I want to have a go at acting. And he's now worked with us on three different projects professionally uh, with no prior training and we've just made his life story into a play and toured it to the Edinburgh Fringe Festival this summer, receiving four star reviews. Funding from the National Lottery will really help us to keep on growing, keep expanding and we just want to keep changing people's lives and showing people the value of being involved in the arts. Not only changed my life, she's changed quite a few other people's. Mm. We all wouldn't be where we are now if it weren't for gear.